The single tank on display at Russia's Victory Parade, which commemorates the end of the Second World War, uh, is the second time this has now happened, and uh, it does, hasn't stopped Vladimir Putin from uh, lambasting the West and from declaring the uh, forces of Russia, the victorious forces uh, over Nazi Germany, the, uh, the, the T-34, the legendary Soviet tank from World War II, the only tank that was on display, uh, presumably because all the others were busy in some other field, and uh, it, it suggests a dwindling supply of tanks, uh, as also a dwindling supply of um, heroic individuals to parade um, or to stand to attention in order to receive the parade of soldiers that walk past. Of course, Putin was there, uh, having been dug out of the Smeg fridge, um, and, uh, or at least his representative in human form was there, having been dug out of the Smeg fridge. And I'm sure the the um, the bodily remnant of Putin, uh, the 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 original P Putin, proto Putin, is still popping uh, in uh, in in the fridge next to the uh, frozen peas. But I think um, at the same time there was an effort to uh, drive a new. Um, line coming in from the north uh, down into Ukraine, a new attempt to seize Kharkiv and to uh, and, and, and to create more chaos there. Mr. Putin, the concept of Putin, it's he's not going to give up, and. At the moment, the most important priority for the West is to see the conclusion of the Israeli campaign against Palestine, which is a distraction and a um, uh, and a destruction of weapons that could otherwise be sent to Ukraine. Newspaper headlines are filled with what Israel is doing. The real war is going on in Ukraine, and in the uh, when when history is written, Mr. Netanyahu will have to explain his savage attack on civilians for what? Simply to perpetuate a war so that he keeps out of the courts. There are many ways this could have been managed, and six months of distraction has done as much as the uh, tardy uh, response of the American politicians to uh, following up their rhetoric with the reality of helping. I hope it's not too late.